Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of BFE Outdoor TV. On today's episode, we're gonna do some coon hunting, baby. Uh, we've been pretty busy. I've had to work a pretty good bit with all that cold weather. I'm trying to keep that electricity on. But uh checking some things around the house here that just finally thawed out today. My faucet was froze over. But it looks like it's uh, defrosted now. If you can see it, full of water. So that's, hopefully it ain't broke nowhere. Don't look like it. But we have some exciting news. Uh, we're getting a new puppy. She's coming out of Minnesota, three and a half months old. Uh, I descended off a of big country. That's her grandpa. So uh, we're, we're excited about that. Uh, you know, like we said in an earlier video, we're going to start moving away from Jade. And uh, she's still she's still going to be around, like I said. She's going to a family, uh, some of my family. Because she's a good dog, and she may pan out. Just right now, she's just not not what we're looking for to, to breed to right now. Just want to thank you all for watching. Uh, hope you enjoy the video. Today, our, some of the hunting we got on here is a few, a few different mixed hunts. Uh, we've been doing real good. Goose has been doing really good here lately. Uh, he's been drifting tracks. We need to get him on some hot coon because he's he's been we've been just hunting wild you know wild coon in the public land and it's starting this time of year is starting to become tough. They're starting to spread out pretty good. And uh, you know it's just tough on a young dog. Good for him some, but it's also good to keep his confidence up. So. We may try to get in a little thicker coon, which deer season is about to end in Texas. So uh, we'll be able to hunt some deer leases again where them coons have been getting fat on all them corn feeders. So we'll probably hit a few of those, knock knock a few out to him. And uh, hoping we'll be able to hunt some competition hunts. I'm not just the biggest competition hunter, but uh, you know, Braden enjoys it a lot. He's trying to get better into it so we're gonna start running the roads a little when we have some time i'm not having to work hopefully the weather holds but thanks for watching hope you enjoy the video see ya got jay treat up solo goose is pushing the track further to our left here all we tree on is freaking green trees almost Christmas and we're still fighting the leaves. Crazy, man. Stay tuned while we hunt it up. Talk to him, son. That's a boy. Yeah, we're going to watch him. We'll look for some eyes, baby. Put a hammer down on it. Let's go see. Well, this is a... I think they got him, but the tree is on the only freaking tree that's full of leaves. And it's pretty tall and gnarly, so I'm not going to spend a lot of time on it. Push on it, so I don't know if it's here or not. We're just going to push on. Call it slick. Tree it up, babe. Talk to him now. Let's see if we can find some meat. What well, Michael Bryan's got? They were all under thirty dollars. They were twenty, you know, twenty something bucks. bucks. And then when I bought all them before I left Thetford, I bought all them boys one. They were all they were twenty eight dollars a piece. The last thing I bought though was forty bucks. That was for eighty. No. The last thing I bought was around. sixty. 
I bought it to pass around for Christmas to you. Oh, oh. Hey, go shut my truck door. I think you ended up winning. Or, or David. No, I didn't. I didn't. Yeah, I didn't it might have been David. You got it. That's when we was over at, uh, at the bounce house. Yeah. <laughs> When I was talking to him, I had to go by last night and we went and looked look at them trailers. Uh oh, shh, shh, shh. There's two on the three of them. Come here and bust one of these down. 